Paso County Commissioners today unanimously passed amendments to the fire ordinance. These changes will affect what you can and cannot burn and whether you can use or buy fireworks next 4th of July. News 5's Mayo Davison is joining us in the studio to explain what you need to know. Mayo. Yeah, these recent changes is what uh, state law led county commissioners to consider these changes. They go into effect immediately and aren't drastic. Rather, they make it easier and clearer for the community to follow. For 30 years, affordable flags and fireworks has helped the Colorado Springs community light up the sky all while dealing with restrictions. In the past, we've always just relied on the fire ban information. So if we were under a fire ban, stage one fire ban, then we couldn't sell fireworks. That was our understanding. All that has changed with the passing of amendments to the fire ordinance. The clarification of the, of the law is very beneficial and the fact that we now know what to expect. They say the previous ordinance wasn't clear and caused them supply issues. Our suppliers in Denver, so we made several trips up there to fill up our van and bring fireworks down. And uh, frankly, we sold everything we got. El Paso County commissioners say the changes to the fire ordinance will provide more clarity when it comes to burn restrictions and fireworks. A lot of those rules existed in the ordinance previously, um, but we did, a, we did also clean up uh, the ordinance a little bit to make it easier to use. It restricts open fires and open burning in unincorporated areas of the county during times of high fire danger. It also requires a permit to slash piles of brush and tree limbs. The biggest change, they now have to draft and pass a written resolution to approve a fireworks ban when there is a stage one or two fire ban in place. There's some value in that in the sense that the Board of County Commissioners is a board that the public interacts a lot with. So that gives opportunities for the community to provide input. To help keep the community safe, even if it means a fireworks ban. Well, the nice thing is there's usually some, some very nice displays. If county commissioners pass the resolution, the ban would go into effect countywide and only will last a year. County commissioners do recommend residents be aware of restrictions in their own area since local municipalities and fire districts may have their own.